our chest twice and throw up the four and say we will uh, in unison. And it just means, you know, we're going to do this. We will do what we need to do. It's not we can, it's we will. Carrying that mantra forward, you know, through the season, you guys ran the tape one, you know, beat UCLA twice. I remember exactly where I was watching it. A lot of people around here do too. You know, moving forward in the future, um, you know, having you back here on Oxford is, is great for our guys to see. Um, you know, we're definitely going to follow you and, and uh, take anything we can learn from you, especially our quarterbacks. Uh, we got a pretty good quarterback going, you know, young guys too, freshman guys that's coming up. And, um, but anything you want to say to the team, uh, you know, just kind of words of advice of what you got, you know, we're, we're getting some exposure now. You know, yeah. So kind of dealing with that, um, any advice you have? Yeah, I mean, we're kind of dealing with the same thing uh, as Gonzaga. People are starting to notice us a little more. And uh, you're going to get the attention, and with that comes the hype. And uh, one of my favorite quotes is, what you do is so loud, I cannot hear what you say. And that's kind of something that we've uh, embraced at Stanford, and I hope Gonzaga does too. Just not, don't pay attention to the hype. Don't pay attention to what people are saying on ESPN, on DC Sports Fan. Um, you know, that's just all for entertainment. Control what you can control. And uh, people are saying that we have a, a chance to make it to the national title, but that's not in our control. The only thing we can control is the Pac-12, and that's all we're looking forward to is uh, winning the Pac-12 championship. Well, sounds great. Appreciate your time. Great to be back. Absolutely.